Hey friends. Okay. Thank you so much for watching my journey. Um, tonight is the night before my surgery. So I just wanted to real quick show you guys what I packed in my surgery bag. Just some quick little things. Um, a lot of people were asking like in the Facebook groups. Um, so I figured I compiled some things that I saw from YouTube, from Facebook, and just asking my doctor as well. So here are some things. I, I don't think you should pack too much. So I'm just going to tell you what I packed. I'm not going to show you because it's like all packed up right now and I don't feel like unpacking and then repacking. So I'm just going to list them. Um, but firstly, just like toiletries and like specifically the mini toiletries, um, which I could show you right now, but they're like, like the little mini shampoos. I got shampoo, uh, soap, like body soap, body lotion, um, hand sanitizer, deodorant. Um, what else? Oh, toothpaste, toothbrush. Um, I already said a body soap, right? Shampoo, conditioner, and oh, Listerine, like the little mini ones. So all of those in little minis, and I just have that in a pouch. And then I also have chapstick and lip gloss, because apparently your lips get really dry after surgery. Um, and then I also have the hauls, or like um, cough drops. I don't know if I'll be able to take that, but I added it just in case. Um, so I added gas pills, because um, you have a lot of gas after surgery, since they're filling your chest cavity up with gas you kind of are going to have a little bit of gas pain until it passes. So to make that transition easier, gas pills. Um, and then loose clothing. Um, so I have a couple dresses and then like loose pants and a loose shirt. And then also socks. And I have also slippers, like house slippers. Um, and then also a heating pad for the pain. A lot of people are saying that a heating pad helped, like just putting it on the chest to like relieve some of that gas pain. Um, and then I have a water bottle that I have my water bottle that I'm going to fill up with water and then I'm also going to bring just like a regular water bottle as well so I can refill it if needed um and then I have a blanket and I love that blanket because it actually turns into a pillow so it's like a blanket and a pillow but if you don't have that then you should bring a blanket and a pillow um a hairbrush hair ties uh let's see what else sorry I have everything written down so I'm looking at it oh most important thing um my laptop laptop case and laptop charger and then i also have extra phone chargers and the bricks as well um because you never know and if you're just stuck in a hotel room the easiest thing you can do is bring a laptop and like watch netflix or whatever oh and i also am bringing my airpods and a notebook and pen if i need to write anything um let's see what else oh my wallet obviously and i think that's it yeah you don't need much but um that is it that's the journey and you guys it's happening i'm so excited i can't believe it's happening so yeah my next couple videos will be well the next video i have is how the pre-op diet went so definitely check that out and then after that it's straight surgery vlog so here we go but anyway thank you so much for watching my journey and i hope you continue to watch if you have any questions for me leave them in the comments and that is it you guys don't forget to love yourself every day